நீயில்லாத நாளல்ல நாளாகுமா நீயில்லாத வாழ்வல்ல வாழ்வாகுமா Gospel of Matthew chapter 8 verse 8 Saint Julian replied Lord I do not deserve to have you come under my roof but just say the word and my servant will be healed This man had great belief in the word of Jesus Christ Lord I do not deserve to have you come under my roof but just say the word It means that this man believed that Jesus was omnipotent He believed that Jesus need not to be there in his house to do the miracle. He believed that the miracle would happen even if Jesus uttered one word far away from his house. He believed that his servant will be healed. In Psalm 107 verse 20, we read that God sent out his word and healed them. This man believed it. This man had a hundred soldiers under him. They would go and come as per his command. Still the centurion realized that he had no authority over the sickness and believed that Jesus had authority over every sickness and darkness. He believed that Jesus is Lord, the miracle worker, and he believed that his word could heal anyone from any part of this planet. This shows his faith in Jesus' might and power. Jesus was amazed at his faith and said, "Truly I tell you, I have not found anyone in Israel with such great faith." And his servant was healed at that moment. Jesus didn't have to visit the house, and he just said, "Go, let it be done just as you believed it would." And at that very moment, the servant was healed. The reason behind this supernatural incident is the centurion's faith. Dear people of God, you may be suffering some severe sickness. You may be broken and hopeless. Doctors may have given up hope. Others may ridicule you. You may be fighting on a deathbed. The Lord is telling you, if you believe in the power of Jesus and pray with faith, Jesus will do a miracle in your life now, even as you listen to this. May the Lord do a miracle in your life. May the Lord heal from all your sickness and pain. May the Lord make all the tumors disappear and dissolve all the blockages. Our Lord is able and mighty to save you from any stage of sickness. Just as Jesus healed the dying servant from where he was, he will heal you and extend your life. He will bless you. He will lift your head high. He will never forsake you. Your situation will change. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God bless you.